hi and welcome back to my channel if you are new here welcome please consider subscribing before you go and if you are returning welcome as well thank you for joining me on another video i hope you're doing really really well today i'm going to be unboxing or unbagging shall i say my ipsy glam bag plus this was for the month of september I am in the UK, so the bags, boxes, etc. do take longer to arrive to me than they do than if I was in America. So Ipsy is an American subscription box. This is the middle size subscription. So the first one is the Glam Bag, which is $12 a month, I believe. This one is the Glam Bag Plus, which is $25 per month and then you have the glam bag ultimate which is $50 a month so this is the middle of one and then I, uh, I have to send it to a shipping company I use my US and then it's forwarded on to me so it does tend to take a little bit longer I have had it for a while though but I just haven't had chance to film so I'm a little bit behind but yes it's here and it actually matches my nails quite well so happy days i'm just going to open it up and show you what's inside so the bags have recently changed we do get these little drawstring bags now which i actually do quite like so yes i do quite like these bags i've seen the one for october it's absolutely beautiful so i can't wait for that one to come so i'll just go through the items one by one i'll show you what i've picked for myself and what ipsy chose for me you do get to choose three items for yourself now rather than one which is nice. So the first one is from uh, La Rousse Beauty, I believe. And this is a brush set. And I did actually choose this myself. So these are the brushes here. Hang on, let's turn them all the right way. Hang on, they're all the right way except this one. So that's them just there. Hang on, this one's still upside down. So I thought this was a nice little brush set that you get a set of five here. Get, what's it? Two face brushes, is it? Oh, it does tell you what they're actually for. So let's take this one out. Oh, that is so, so soft. But I like the handles as well. It's, I've seen a few people get these and I was like, I'd really quite like those. Just because the handles are a little bit different. I thought they were quite nice. But yeah, these are so super soft, so I'm going to enjoy these. So this is the Angle Contour Brush. I'm going to like that one. Not that I contour, so I'll probably use it for something else, but I like that one. Then we get the, what's this one? A Flat Foundation Brush. Oh, that's very dense indeed. I'll enjoy that one. This is a Kabuki Brush. Is it? Is it? Okay, if that's what they say, but yeah, very, very soft again. Then we have a shadow brush, and all the handles are the same, and they are all super soft. And then we have a tapered blending brush. This one doesn't want to pop out. Again, very, very soft. So that was a little brush set. These are all vegan, cruelty-free, hypoallergenic, and they are synthetic bristles. So yep. Yeah, I do quite like these and as I say I did pick these ones myself next we have this one this was an item that was chosen for me this is the oh, was it chosen for me no it wasn't I actually picked this myself because I don't think the choices were that great this month because if you remember watching my um my last ipsy the, was it my last one I think I got one of these a similar item anyway in my other Ipsy. So this was the Murad. It's Essential C Day Moisture Broad Spectrum SPF 30. Uh, so this one's got vitamin C in it as well as being an SPF. So it's a 50 mil. So it is a full size item. Um, and as I say, it has got SPF. It's PA++. I'm not too sure what that means but it says on the back to reveal radiance and protect skin from uv damage with this vitamin c rich spf moisturizer potent antioxidant ginkgo biloba leaf extract helps shield skin from environmental aggressors such as pollution for a glowing healthy looking complexion complexion and it's dermatologist developed as well oh it's got an expiry on it as well that's quite good 
excuse me, it's 11 21 expires next year. See, I did choose this one, even though I have got something quite similar by the same brand. Um, this was an item that was chosen to me by Ipsy. So this is by Trestique, and this is a mini lip glaze set. Um, and this is the shades that are included. So I'm not going to open this up because I'm not sure if I'm going to keep it or not. So this is it includes Shout Beach Sheer, Paris Pink, Georgia Peach and English Rose. So that's the four colours just there. And they are quite cute. That's what they look like. The lids look like little pencils as well. So I'm not sure if I'm going to keep this one though because I do have a lot of lip items that I need to use up. I'm just not sure but it's, it is quite cute it's definitely good if you're traveling and you know because they are quite small there are a mini set and you do get four of them in there yeah they are quite cute so that's an item that Ipsy chose for me another item that Ipsy chose for me was this one and it's in like a little sandwich bag type doodah so there's two sheet masks here by star skin so the first one is a star skin foaming peeling puff and it's a um uh yeah a foaming puff <laughs> uh travel friendly so the step one you cleanse your face and pat dry and it is just like a puff that you massage over your skin for two to three minutes and then you rinse afterwards so it's not a sheet mask as such but it's meant to be peeling okay we'll see how that goes that's the first one and the second one is a sheet mask and this is a firming biocellulose face mask so that's that one there it says here it's a non-water and it's 72% coconut based so that's nice there so I'll definitely give these a go Oh, yeah, the expiry date does have an expiry. So 0523. What's this one? 0523. So they've got some good dates on them if I don't want to use them straight away. But these two, I suppose that was one pick that Ipsy chose for me as well. And then the last item is another one that I chose for myself. So I thought it was really cute. So this is by Wonder Beauty. And it's the Wondress Seascape Eyeshadow Palette. And I saw this and I just thought it was so, so cute. I had to choose it. Uh, if I can get in here, I'll show you the shade. See if I've got some scissors handy. Because it's got these little... What are those? sticker doodle things that make... That's it. That's got it. That's got it. I can get in it's shape proof sealed oh that hurt now i still can't get in i'm gonna have to rip the box and i really don't want to rip the box so i like to keep things some things in the boxes i'm no good at keeping skincare boxes and i suppose they're the boxes that you should keep come on it's shape proof it doesn't want to get out at all ah Got it, got it, got it, got it. Now I'm in. Ha ha. See, it's Shay One packaging nil. So that's what it looks like. It has got a mirror, but look at those shades. Aren't they just gorgeous? I think they're really pretty. The one that I was really interested in was these two here. I'm going to sneeze. Oh, excuse me. So sorry. Two. There we go. I'll probably have a third in as well. So it was the sea foam and the coastal. See, I'm not very adventurous, but I just really, really like them. Ooh. That doesn't feel how I expected it to feel. Right, that's the sea foamy one. Let's give it a little swatcheroo. Oh, it does feel nice. That's it there. It's not showing it very well in my crappy lighting, which is just my bedroom light does look better on my finger to be fair and then we've got the coastal Ooh, oh wow that is so so nice oh it's gorgeous and that's that one there 
still it looks more black on the picture what am i doing that's um very very crappily just from what's left on my finger but yeah i really like this and i think it's gorgeous and because it's so teeny weeny you can take it with you anywhere as well it's perfect travel size so yeah i really liked that so i chose that as well and again the um the the options I don't think were the best that they have been. There's definitely been better months. But so uh, that's another one that I chose. But I do really like this. I mean, that probably gives you a better view of the colours just there. Better than my swatches anyway. But just to recap then, we have the teeny palette, by well, the travel size one. I have the brush set that I'm really looking forward to using. We have the Murad um, Vitamin C and the SPF. We have the Trestique. These are like a mini lip glaze set. We have the two masks. One, two, three, four, five. And that's it. And then, of course, we have the little bag, which I think is quite cute. Oh, you definitely use these more than having all the different um, masks as well. Plus, these are like a material one, so I think they're easy to find something to do with anyway. And the cards that you just get in these... It doesn't tell you about the products anymore. But yeah, thank you ever so much for watching my video. If you have enjoyed it, please give me a big thumbs up because I really do appreciate it. And I shall hopefully see you in the next one. Bye.